Number 10, Luis Malanaga. Number 12, Jeffrey Henderson. Number 16, Drew Wynn. And number 19, Francisco Septin. And now, for your Argus Dragons. Number 3, Sam Manikowski. Number 5, Will Mills. Number seven, Chino Roke. Number eight, Karsden McCramer. Number nine, Caleb Ellis. Number 10, Owen Nifong. Number 11, Pablo Mata. Number 14, Teddy Redinger. Number 16, Jeremiah Riddle. Number 23, Shane Stevens. And in the goal, Colton Markley. <coughs> well, all right, we're back. <clears throat> all right, ready for some soccer. Ready for some soccer action. And he's starting to see is this uh, Coach Vanderbilt giving them all their start here against a big opponent. And... Uh, much better weather tonight. We haven't. The past couple of days have been hot and humid. The boys are going to enjoy this lo low 60s, <laughs> high 50s weather for sure. No, I think they wondered that 80 feels like 93 uh, degree <laughs> weather back. I think that's that's what makes it interesting. So yeah, I was uh, I was at the Tippy Valley JV game <laughs> oh on boy. Tuesday. Woo! And everybody's like, the boys are just out of it. They're just not awake. I was like, no, it's that bad out there. It's, I went for a run. I ran about two and a half miles, and it was miserable. It is that hot. And the people got to realize that it takes it out of you quick. Luckily, the boys were able to get together for that second half. Ended up pulling out the win 5-3. <laughs> yeah, five straight un uh, unanswered goals. That, uh, that tends to let you win a few games. Yeah. <laughs> so... Well, here we go. It'll be the Eagles kick off. <laughs> Look at that. Jeez, it's it's Randy. Randy's back in the house. Uh, Mr. Stern's back up. He's probably loving this weather, being from Florida area. He's got a coat on. What a princess. <laughs> Florida's made him soft already. Dragons have that kickoff. They're going after the ball here with the Eagles with the kickoff. So rotating in. Plays it forward, and Markley Has comes on out, comes out and ah. scoops it up. Wait a little bit long on that one. <laughs> He's a little rusty. He, he sat out a few games, played out on the field while his arm is healing. Pablo with the head forward. Throw in for the Dragons. Throws in, headed forward, and the play's kicked right out. <coughs> so, a little shuffle there. Some seniors out. Some players moved around. Chino Roke tries to get through, and Culver Military clears it out. Broke up. Goes through the middle and kicks it over, and the keeper scoops it up. That was a good little hustle by. Uh, yeah. Okay, playing through the middle, light on that pass. Both teams seem like to be feeling each other out. That's Way off. Easy call. Yep. Well, we'll see if the Dragons uh, work the old offsides trap today. Plays it forward. Mills steps forward, plays it up. Pablo can't get to it. And 
And there's the ball. <laughs> it's going to be a throw. afterwards. Yeah. And there's a quick throw, and he's got to move. He's got to run on. Plays it back in the middle. Good ball, and it's What's way up? over. Let's see what Markley's goal kicks look like. Oh, he was taking them when, when he was on the field, so he should be used to this. Nice height. Good angle. Keeps it wide. Headed back towards the center. Richard's got to do a little better on that. Plays it, breaks it up, throw in for the Eagles. Mills heads it forward. No, Manikowski. Manikowski. He's looking for the sideburns. <laughs> <coughs> Plays it wide. Mills steps out. Across the center. Manikowski breaks it up. They drop it. And Markley with the scoop. A little bit of a weird spin on that for yep. Colton to deal with. Not much power on it. Marco with the smash. Roke heads it forward. Mata heads it back over to Roke. Roke's making a run and splits it. Turns. Plays it down the line. Stone. Crosses and it's broke up. Might have been offside, and the AR was not in position to call it when that first initial pass was made. Redinger drops it. Markley hits it up in the mids. And the play is broke up. Richards. Oh, and it's played backwards. Shot blocked, and a save by Manikowski afterwards. The rebound, good yeah. save by Markley. And some sloppy play in the midfield to allow that ball to go back. Curls, header, tipped out, out again. And they need to clear out of the box, and they do, and it's way off. Marcus seems a little asleep on this. You uh, think? <laughs> first few minutes here. Both, both teams looked a little sluggish at the beginning, and CMA starting to wake up a little bit. <clears throat> Argus needs to uh, play with some purpose right now. Played it forward. Nifong. Runs through, hits it forward. Headed back. And Culver Military has it. Splits him. Shot. No good. Goal kick for the Dragons. All right, boys need to wake up here. Bring the ball down. Have a purpose. Uh, yeah. A little bit of ping pong at the moment. First touch goes to the Eagles. Richards plays the feet. Nice little give and go and again. And that's what, oh, and I'm oh, lucky off lucky the back enough. heel. But that's what we're talking about. Four little passes, and here, down the line they went. You know, definitely looked like we had a bit of purpose to that one. Mills with the block. Throw in for. That was a good connection between Mills and Pablo, and then up forward again. Yeah, just unfortunate to come off Chino's heel. If he could have stepped over that leg yep. between his legs, he'd have been off. Off and gone. Plays forward. Manikowski shot and a goal. Too easy. Flat footed. A nice finish by number three. Yep. Thompkins. Thompkins. Marcus needs to uh Get their defensive back line organized here. Broke up. And Culver smells blood in the water now. 
and is attacking big time. Gonna get a run on it. Yep. Here he goes. He's got steam. He's heading to the end line. Nifong's gonna have to use his strength and his speed against this team. That's what the Dragons are gonna need to to go forward. <clears throat> you gotta get some more of that combo play. Yep. Headed out. Should be a corner. The biggest thing is he's is, is Argus can't get the ball at their feet and then try to decide yep. what to do. They have to know what they're <laughs> wanting to do before they get that ball. You play so much faster if you can anticipate. Uh, yep. Corner Mills. Near post. Oh, and he clears out past him. Broke up. Manikowski back in the middle to Roke. Roke with the missed hit. McCramer going to be able to outrun him. Miss hit. Miss hit. It's out on the Culver Military. It's a Dragon's Ball with ease. Throws it in. Three military players step right towards it. It's like it. nobody's ready. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yep. yep. Culver's out. He kicked his leg out while he was on the ground and got yeah. stepped on for trouble. Headed in. Knife on, can't get to it. Plays advantage. And there's a long ball forward. And he's... Back in the middle, oh, broke up. Broken up by the ringer. <laughs> it was a well-timed run. I couldn't really see. I didn't know if he was off by about a half step or if it was just perfectly timed. Our, yeah. Our angles, his angle's better than our angle. So. Yeah. And he was in position. I mean, that's all you can really ask of the ARs is to be in position. And then make a good call. <laughs> well, sometimes it's hard to do. Yeah. Out of bounds and a goal kick for the Dragons. Probably the hardest call in sports. Well, just about. Turns. Owen goes straight up. Redinger. Plays it forward. And it's going to be, it's too obvious. You're, you can't just play it straight forward when there's three players on Chino. That's not going to work. They're going to have to do some move at some angles. Out step. Gets it in. McCramer. Oh. And I have a feeling Marco, you might be a very busy customer today. <laughs> yeah, the the defense is is struggling. Yeah, that was uh, that clear was a perfect forty five ball to the other team. Roke needs to go. <coughs> oh, he should immediately went to Markley, just like Nifong did. Nifong, there goes Chino Roke. Curls back corner post header, and it's over. Oh, ooh, just nice that. work, and that's much better play. Yeah, potentially Mills could have called uh, Richards off that one. Yeah. He had the better angle. Richards would have had to jump too high to get a clean downward. <laughs> made connection. Direction on it. He did make connection, but yep. just a little bit too high for him. Okay, Mills. Ellis. Oh, it is Ellis. Dove in there. Good idea. Yep. Good play. Manikowski's going to outrun C. Fiver. That was probably smart yeah. by Sam. Yeah. The way things have been going, just team. play it out of yep. bounds, get yourselves readjusted. 
Get your team back and set up. McCramer breaks it up, and it's going to be. Oh, yep. no. I figured that's what he'd call. It would have been a hard one to see from a goal or field side. Yep. Plays it short, drops it to him. Here comes the cross. Goes wide, and he's making his run in. And he scores, and he went right in unmarked right behind him. And that's just too easy, unfortunately, for the Dragons. That was a good ball in, but definitely a preventable goal. And the Dragons are down 2 0. Goal, number seven, Philippe Holmberg, assisted by number 10, Luis Malanga. From Mexico uh, with the assist. <laughs> and Sweden with the goal. <laughs> so, nice ball over. Richards gives chase. Place it forward. Broke up by Stone. And a miss hit straight to the other feet. Foul. Richards. Out, throw in for the Eagles. Oh, we'll let him way up that. Yeah, there you go. Back him up. I was going to say, they got about 15 yards out of that. <laughs> well, they tried. It was behind midfield, actually. Uh, that's when it first went out. Yeah, well, they're not paying too close attention. Broke up by Mills. Rogue hits him. Nice little turn back. Gets it over to Richards. Oh, he oh. doesn't get it. Oh, my word. He was straight to goal with that one if he gets it. A long hit. Markley. Gonna scoop it up. Plays it forward. <clears throat> hits it back. Good touch. Going to split, fakes, drops it. Headed. Manikowski heads it wide. Throw in for the Eagles. Plays it wide. Riddle. Can't get there, but pressure causes a bad pass. Throwing for the Dragons. Looks like the Dragons are starting to come alive here a little bit. We're seeing a little bit faster moving legs. Riddle throws it in. Richards ran off of it. Missed. Sir. I think it's a handball because it went right off his arm. Yep. Yep. They all like, they're all trying to play innocent. I love that. <laughs> it's a, oh, I, I didn't do anything. What? Who, me? Uh -huh. Yeah, so here's a free kick for the Dragons. Actually, it was in tighter now. I, it was up by the edge of the circle. But That's what I thought. This is actually a better position, to be honest. Yeah. It's easier to drop it lower over the wall. This is where you bend it up and over. The play's on, and it's to oh. the keeper, and nobody's there. Riddle tried. He took off. Yep. There's just too much distance to cover with him holding the line. Manikowski misjudges. And gets it back. There it goes. Yep. Yeah, not from behind. They'll call that every time. Yep. Even if you get the ball, you still can't get to the body first. 
So Roke puts it forward. Owen Nifong heads it forward. Hits it. Mills can't get to it. Now he plays it wide. Headed. Well, Tompkins is definitely comfortable on the ball <laughs> for yes, the is. Eagles. And slip and fall out of Riddle. And makes the touch on it. That can be throw in for the Eagles. Not the feet. Just kicked straight out to an eagle. Offsides. Off yep. See the gradual little kick five yards back to give themselves plenty of time. Yep. Just those little things. It's different, different style play. Played forward. Long. I'd like to see us work it out of there instead of just kicking it every time. Yep. Nifong has it, plays it forward. Miss Hatter. That can be dragon throw in. Roke surrounded by three. Richards not there you go. Gets it. Drops. Crossed. Did Nifong no over him? Just over him. Ellis. Shot. Broke up. Played wide. Offside. And he's offside. That was easy call. Yep. Wish, I wish they'd get on the whistle a little bit earlier on that. Yeah. You get a little bit. You get that live play if, with the keeper. You got a chance somebody get hurt. If he's making the effort for it, he doesn't have to touch it. You know he's going for it. It's obvious in that case. Blow the whistle. Prevent possible injury. I agree 100%. That's, I'm not a big fan of how they changed the offsides rule where they want you to wait until they get down. you got players that are wasting energy, potential injuries. It's yeah. just silly. If they're offsides and they make an attempt for it, call it. Get it in. Get it going. Start the game back up. Subs in for the Dragons, Markley and Pablo. In for the Dragons, number six, Cameron Markley. And number 11, Pablo Mata. Mills put in a good shift. Richards. Nifong. Plays it wide. Riddle. Foot race. Can he get there? Can't. And off goes the Eagles. We're just going to have to keep up the intensity, keep up the speed. It got competitive there for a little while. We just got to keep the hustle up. Ball forward. Stone breaks it up, but he gets it back. And cleared out by Nifong. And there should have been a touch on that. Should be Argus throw. Nope. Nope. Didn't see it. Not going to call it. <laughs> and it's in and out. Argus throw anyway. Yep. Ball don't lie. Yeah. On that one. Well, after they let a couple, couple in, the Dragons have calmed down quite a bit. And cleared out. Goes wide. Riddle heads it out for a corner kick. I know uh, Mark, they wanted that, but uh, a great effort by Teddy. He, he got there. The I think Culver would have beat the keeper on that one. And Ringer not stepped in. 
Headed out by Nifong. Who's going to get there? Eagles takes a check. Looks. Headed back forward. Hit up. And it's a long ball to the Markley. Keeper has it. And he miss hits it. It's going to go wide. And it's off of number 10. Alanga. Uh-oh, 12 around, two of them. Plays it wide oh, out. Miss it. Miss it on the pass. Ellis. Cesar to Mata. Mata just oh, uh, took his eyes off of it. Looking forward instead of watching to get his foot on it. Good turn. Good defense. And McCramer keeps it in. It gets to Mata. And there's three people. That Too ball is not going to work. He had Owen coming. Yeah. Got to be square. smart. You got to go wide. Why hit it where there's three defenders on one? The understanding of the game needs to improve on that aspect of it. Headed out. Gina Roque has time. Crosses. It's a sailor, and oh, it's God. off of the bodies, and it's loose, and it's corner kick. And the Dragons putting some pressure on now. That was a good ball in, floating back there to Nifong and to uh, Mata, but no one was able to put it right in. And Nifong in, riddle out. Outswinger from Stone. And it's straight on. And it's a header. Oh, my word. What a save. Oh, my word. A diving, flying, catty corner header from Nifong. And uh, just went off the post or a body or something there and didn't go in. It wasn't from a lack of effort. That's that's what you want to see out of the Dragons yeah. battling. He threw himself with that one. That was, that was pretty. <laughs> broke up and then broke up again. Strides a little outstep chipper and he gets it to his man. And there's the through ball. And Markley's going to have it with ease. Plays it long. Roke. Got four around him. First touch goes long. Over to. Culver, and he goes through three. Four. Mata plays it to Chino, who's got three around him again, and tries to drag it back, and it's broke up. Yeah, Argus is pushing forward too soon. Going to have to move laterally, get some yep. build-up play, get numbers in their favor. Manikowski's got some minutes. Heads it back to Markley. Markley scoops it. Broke up. Manikowski hits it long and wide. Throw in for the Eagles. The Dragons are getting more pressure and more lively, but they've got to be a little bit understanding. If you're outnumbered, you got to just slow down and move it in with uh, Build some, play. some passing and some... Uh, Checking runs, creating some uh, channels and whatnot, but 15 minutes left in the first. Good throw. Over McCramer, good settle by number five. He turns. Broke up by Stone. Hits it forward. Pablo. Because I'm going to bring that down and control it. Ellis. Bring heads it, it forward, it. and it's ping pong again. Now Nifong hits it wide there over the mark. Now we got open player. Oh, first, first touch first is a little one. soft on that one. Yep. So it goes a little soft as in quality. <laughs> so therefore it went off a little hard and got to where they could get to it. So Mills coming back in for Ellis. Number five, Will Throws into the box. Fortunate to get a corner kick out of that. They were outnumbered as Chino had four around him again. 
All right. Well, the Dragons almost had the last corner in. Let's see what they can do here. Markley's taking this one. Had it out. Not near the height that needed. Foot race. Manikowski is going to get there. Plays it forward. Markley. Goes right around him. Mills applies the pressure. Headed over Manikowski. It's a foot race between Stone. It's going to drop it back. And Markley. He's got time and hits it out. We got a pole there, maybe? Yep. Yeah, it was kind of obvious. Good ball by Stone. Roke doesn't get to it. Markley runs over to get it. I'd like a throw out here to the right. Well, I tell you what. Cars and McCramer needs to get wide, and we need to start building. CMA does not mind kicking it long. Tries to get it through with four of them. Yeah, handball. And Owen was making the run. Yep. I'd play it on the ground now, right to Owen. Look at him. He's wide yep. open. Yep. Play it to his feet. Oh, too late. They're going to cover him. You know they're going to mark the big guy. Yep. That pass was wide open. Well, Kramer's open. Four whites in the middle. Chino hits it wide. Gives up a throw in. Manikowski plays it out. Good job to keep his feet there. Yeah, he got <laughs> nimble. <laughs> Pablo turns him back and gets turned right back around. Go kick. Stone with the defensive pressure plays it off of him, or it's a goal kick for the Dragons. <coughs> Call from military has it again. Tompkins. Tell you what, Pablo's playing some fire tonight. Yep. Oh, Chino turned the wrong way. I know where you are on the pitch, boys. Headed forward. Oh, oh Sam's fortunate to knock that down. Yep. Foul from behind. Right to their player. Unfortunately, they have to hide. Oh, I mean. No advantage. Lost his advantage. Free kick. Hops right up as soon as the whistle's blown. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I love it. Somebody's been watching some television. Yep. And the play's on. And Stone read it and clears it out. Roke with the settle, tries to turn, gets around him. Pablo needs to find some space where it can be helpful. There it is, foul. A little bit of a scuffle after that one. That's okay. That's Argus CMA. 
Many a year there were scuffles. <laughs> right, Mr. Snyder? <laughs> there, many a year there was a scuffle or two. Oh, oh, CMA. oh, where's the push on that one? Yeah. Yeah, he did knock him out of position on that. Yeah, he was in his back all the way to the ground. CMA, number 13, Marcus Holmberg. And then for the Dragons, number one, Devin Allen. Allen making his first appearance of the match. See if the little tactician can do something with him. But uh, he'll have good build-up play. That's one thing I do like about Allen. He'll settle it down and work it back and forth. Good ball from Markley. Markley battles through and gets it back. Tompkins turns, throws it to him. Nifong. Spins, can he get a cross in? And it's a cool kick. Oh, unfortunate. Yeah, it looks like uh, Vanderbilt's made some adjustments. Looks yeah. like he's put Mills into the center as a destroyer. Yeah. Got him chasing ball heavy. Well, you got Nifong in the midst. You got Nifong on the wide, and you got Markley on the right hand side. Pushing the back. Yeah. Well, they don't mind doing it because it slows down the pace of the game. Yeah, they got up to the early lead. They they're they're not concerned about. It. They don't want it f they want to break the momentum of the Dragons and it's a long hit. And it's heavy yeah. on goal. Oh. On goal. <laughs> on goal. <laughs> on goal by Culver Military. Those was what there. The three went up and headed it in for him. Stone uh, gave Stone with the big hit. And a little bit fortunate. And you see Mills is there. One yeah. hit, oh, and my goes up and puts it in for him. Yeah. It's called an own goal. So it's uh, don't OG. just put own, own goal. Call for military is all you would announce. But don't even announce it. All right. It's not like that. Nope. So should be. But if it wasn't for a good play, ball forward like that under the pressure. But, uh, yeah, and the Dragons, that we just talked about it, had the low momentum and they were pressuring, and the pressure's paid off a little bit there. A miss uh, communication by uh, Culver Military. The Eagles are back down at our end, battling, and that's taken away by McCramer. Keeps Gets it, it forward. But to see me player. Tompkins has it. Oh, nicely done by Markley. And Picked him clean. Yep. Nifong applied the pressure, and Markley swept it out. Kramer heads it forward. Settled. Turned. Kramer. And Culver has it. And Manikowski hits it, and it's going to be a corner kick. CMA corner. Coach Vanderwill yelling some instruction from the sides. Not sure what he can't hear what he's saying something about the ball but out swinger for the Eagles that ball is not on the line over and, and out. it's out and that's good for the Dragons very unfortunate for the Eagles and as every coach yells if you don't put it in the field of play it's impossible to score <laughs> <laughs> they get frustrated as a coach yes you do and if you look across the beautiful skyline at the top of the screen, you'll see the beautiful pinks and the sunset as Markley hits it forward. And that's a great ball. Can the keeper's going to come out, and they run off of it. Devin Allen's giving chase, and it's played up the line and throw in for the Dragons. And the Dragons smell a little bit of blood in the water and now are applying pressure quickly. Allen out on the Dragons, and they're throwing for the Eagles. 440 left in the match. Oh, first half, sorry. Uh, two to one. Dragons with a bit of fortune. Oh, caught an elbow in the yeah. back of the head there. Miss hit. Markley. Shot. Broke up. Miss touched again, but cleared out by Culver Military. And they are panicking a little bit in the back lines. Nifong giving chase.
Broke up by Manikowski. And it's saved, and it's going to be corner, corner kick. kick. Must have crossed. Yep. Now, number four put it in. But it was a good ball forward from Stone. Or number three put it in? Yep, number three. Tompkins got a goal at each end. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> ah, boy. That's not one of those stats you want to have. It's played low and hard, and he runs onto it. It's broke up, and another corner kick. See you, mate, corner. Nope, nope, goal kick. Nope, goal kick. Last touch from Simi. Little guy with the big hit. Let's see what he's got. And he puts it way out. Devin Allen is going to skip it on. Rope. Oh, missed it with the heel. I'll tell you what, that early pressure through the middle is leading to some CMA mistakes. Yeah, it's a high pressure, and it's causing some issues. Yep. With uh, the academy. Tried to play it quick. Ball wasn't stationary. The official calls it back. Long hit. Looking for some help like the uh, other end. Well, stays in bounds. Beats two. Side volley. Not so much. Didn't get good clean. A, no, good attempt, but. Too long. No, keeps it in play. Long hit. Argus has to roll pressure here. We got two minutes. They can't let up now. Nifong battles. Allen battles. Military. Mal Played in the middle. Spun. Shot. No good. Wide. Minute 30 left in the first half. Goal kick coming up from Stone. <laughs> Knuckles down. Good first touch. Oh, steps on it. And still kept it. He's had his way with McCramer. Yes, he has. Broke up. Roke misses. Wills hits forward. Mills tried to go forward. It's broke up. Needs to go wide. Allen fakes. Oh, and he goes back over to Roke. Roke no, does not go back to, to it. Ball. Uh, unfortunately, it's broke up. Argus had numbers. Yep. Oh, take a Time, settle. Yep. yep. Take a touch. Gets it through to him. Allen puts it back over to Roke. Roke's got the 1v1 and a heavy touch. Can he put it in the middle? He does not. He shoots Should've side net. Yeah, back. right there is in the middle is Colton Markley, Mills, and Allen's waiting for a ball. Yeah, they all put their heads up their yep. heads and said, oh, I was open. <laughs> had numbers big time. I know it's count down for the end of the first half. Dragons are going to go in at a halftime trailing the Eagles 2-1 to one here at Senior Night. Beautiful Eugene Snyder Field. We want to thank everyone for tuning in to Argus TV on RTC TV4. We're going to take a break, and we'll be back for the second half action. Save Neighbors money when you switch other. your home it's phone how service our community to VoIP from RTC. And it's how we do Everyone business. knows that RTC, RTC Fiber Communication is the we area's leading provider of high-speed fiber, internet, fiber optic TV, internet service. Now, RTC service can help save you money on your monthly support. phone bill by switching your phone over to the right internet here. with we invest VoIP, in our same great service, our people, at a fraction of the cost. Contact RTC today to find out more about this money-saving offer. Online at wwwrtc one com. 
RTC cable subscribers. Now you can watch your favorite cable networks wherever you are, on your phone, tablet, or computer. Just log on to www.watchtveverywhere.com. Enter your RTC account information and sign up to watch TV everywhere. Live sports, videos on demand, and more, all for free with your RTC cable subscription. Watch TV everywhere, another great service from RTC. Slow download, constant buffering, Wi-Fi dead zone? Let RTC help. The customer support team at RTC Communications is here to help you with your internet connectivity. Hi, I'm Bonnie, one of the support team members here at RTC. For a small fee, RTC offers a Wi-Fi health check where we will evaluate your in-home Wi-Fi network and assist you with common issues. See what RTC can do for you. Give us a call today. Neighbors help each other. It's how our community works. And it's how we do business at RTC. We know you count on us for fiber internet, TV, and phone service backed by friendly local support. Your hard-earned dollars stay right here as we invest in our community, our people, and smart technology. RTC Fiber Communications. We're your hometown communications provider working hard to be a good neighbor. Whatever phone fits your style, RTC Fiber Communications can save you money when you switch to VoIP. VoIP is a phone service that leverages the power of the internet to save you money on your monthly phone bill. Same great service at a fraction of the cost. Contact RTC today to find out more about this money-saving offer. Online at www.rtc1.com. Want to know what I like best about playing basketball for my high school? I like it because it's a place where my friends get to see me play. I like it because I'm playing for someone besides myself. I'm playing for everybody in my school and every person in my community. Indiana High School Sports. They're more than just a game. Come and see me play. RTC Fiber Communications is proud to announce the new RTC TV4 family of networks. Now you can watch nine local video channels dedicated to covering the events that are important to you from anywhere in the world, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you can watch for free. Just download the mobile app, our new Roku channel, or online at www.rtctv4.com. The RTC TV4 family of networks. Start watching today. Hi, I'm John Oliver with a few reasons why your next pre-owned vehicle should be from Oliver Ford Lincoln. Imagine a 172-point certification along with a 44-point safety inspection. We even get you a vehicle history report. It's for your peace of mind because we treat our customers like family. You even get free car washes for life. So get more for your money and more for your trade with certified pre-owned at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. Oliver Ford is the largest certified pre-owned dealer in Michiana. Our inventory changes daily and you are guaranteed the best customer service in our area. We treat you like family. Every certified pre-owned Ford includes factory-backed warranty coverage, complimentary vehicle history report and lots more. Don't miss out on our end-of-year discounts on all of our good-as-new inventory. Rates low as we have ever seen and the best customer service you have ever experienced. Enjoy full screen television viewing of the new RTC TV4 family of networks anywhere you are with our new Roku channel. Simply purchase a Roku device from RTC or any Roku retailer, connect to your in-home Wi-Fi, then download the RTC TV4 channel. It's that easy. Watch all of our live channels 24-7 for free or subscribe to view all of our videos at your convenience. The RTC TV4 channel on Roku, another great service from RTC. 
RTC Cable subscribers. Now you can watch your favorite cable networks wherever you are, on your phone, tablet, or computer. Just log on to www.watchtveverywhere.com. Enter your RTC account information and sign up to watch TV everywhere. Live sports, videos on demand, and more, all for free with your RTC Cable subscription. Watch TV Everywhere, another great service from RTC. All right, we're back with a little Isaac Smith unofficial stats. <laughs> That's for sure. So shots on goal for the Dragons was two and CMA was three. Uh, uh, Dragons were called with two fouls and uh, handball and Culver Military had seven fouls. They were they were fouling to slow down the pressure and momentum of the game there because uh, they were up to, uh, two to nil and then Stone with a Gabe Stone with a long free kick and some confusion between CMA and the goalkeeper and some pressure from the Dragons allowed an own goal, which uh, put uh, the Dragons uh, one behind. First goal was uh, Tompkins, number three, in the seventh minute, and then uh, Culver got one by number seven, Holmberg, in the 13th minute. But after that, the Dragons settled down. Kind of started putting the pressure on. Uh, yeah, they turned up the pressure with a couple po couple little bit positioning changes worked out. Yeah, we, we moved some extra hustle worked out. Yeah, Coach Vanderwell moved some players, got some different players in, and given some minutes to some people to putting in the effort. And uh, we got one back, and now the Dragons are trailing two to one here at Senior Night for the uh, Dragons. Like we always say, those are unofficial stats because we don't have the time or presence to go ahead and do the true stats and uh, they don't really matter for us anyways it's all done over there on the, the book side the yep. home team keeps stats for the game that's the official record and the official sign offs so uh, but uh, yeah it's a uh, it's a battle at the moment uh, what do you think the first 10 minutes gonna set the tone it's the first 10 minutes of the second half will set the tone it's definitely going to have to be high pre uh, stakes pressure from the Dragons. And uh, now that they've communicated a little better in the back, they've covered each other. But I tell you what, Tompkins and uh, what is it, number 10, Malenga, he is quality on the street, giving yep. Carson McCramer everything that he wants and then some. So the Dragons going to have to uh, work on that and keep it uh, keep it going. Yeah, Carson's used to his speed working out for him, and the um, that number ten, he's got that quick touch. So uh, we're broadcasting tomorrow night. Is that what we're saying? Okay, so we are adding tomorrow night's girls game because it will be the senior night for the Lady Dragons as they take on Bethany Christian and uh, their final home match of the season until postseason that is and then so monday night we'll be covering senior night for the lady dragons volleyball and also covering the first night and round of sectional matchups for the boys sectional uh, for the indiana state sectionals group we have both first round uh, first sectionals for girls and boys and then uh, retain it for the regionals for the boys and regionals for the girls will move to Newton Park uh, to be played so uh, both teams have taken the field so we're gonna have a lot of action coming here from the House of the Dragons as they say coming up so we got games galore we're covering every match that we can for the sectional for the boys and the girls and it's going to be a big uh, matchup. The Dragons will face Culver High School for the boys' side, and the Lady Dragons will face off against Bremen, looking to get a little revenge for a 1-1 tie out of that game. So as the officials take the lines and the sides, we're going to be uh, <laughs> a festival going on there. A soccer fest is what Phil wrote. Yes, soccer fest for <laughs> that time of year. It is. It's October's here. Yeah, we're ready for some snow, some ice. That's fun stuff to play in. So <laughs> it's enough fun to coach in, but 
It's always fun to play in. Reffing is okay because at least you're getting paid. Yep. <laughs> That's the way you got to look at it. It would be a little bit. Sitting on the room and bleachers, uh, yep. yeah, not so much. Yeah, fan-wise is not the best. Dragons play it. Now building up. Pressure. Decent build-up play here. Long pressure, and it rotates to the other side. Pablo goes over. Manikowski's going to go square and wide. McCramer's time and space. Hits it. And it broke up. Tompkins with a good settle. Drops it back. Miss hit. Richards with a nice touch. Chino turns it. Good presence. A shot. And it's no good. Awful oh, ambitious from yeah. that distance. Yeah, Richards was fairly open on the left-hand side as well. Richards was open. And uh, Pablo was making his run. And that's awful ambitious. But... If you don't shoot, you can never score. That's right. Philly's smiling on that. He likes that one. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you can't get the goose if you don't pull the trigger. Yeah. Right? Yeah, try. Broke up. Spun off. Drops. Manikowski splits it. Oh, great pass. Wide open. Oh, oh. It. Unfortunate he looked bounce. Up, he yeah. looked up at the player running out of instead of looking at the ball. Uh, unfortunate <laughs> bounce. Checks the player and loses the ball. Stone with the right foot. Broke up. Allen. Fakes. Allen, he gets around him. Muscled off. It's going to be Culver Academy's ball. They keep it in. Oh, great. By yep, Richards. Richards. Allen. And it's off a of call for military. Oh, they're going to call a free kick. Allen. Pablo's up. Chino could take it quick. Uh, Nifong's far. Have to get up and let it hang if he wants someone to get in on it. That's there it is. Ball. Get him. Oh. And he does. Oh, it's off the post again. Oh, my word. Denied. Allen, Devin Allen heads it and hits the post. So close for the Dragons. Headed back into play. Knife on with the bicycle kick, and here comes Pablo. Oh, my word. We have a foul. Yep. Yep. Foul on Pablo. Uh, Must have foul. clipped his leg. Yep. Devin Allen just about got that one in. That would have been a huge goal for him. Uh, big one for the Dragons. And, uh, this is a uh, good play out of the Dragons. This is setting the tempo for the first uh, 10 minutes of the second half is what we talked about. And, and right now there's a ton of pressure on the uh, Eagles. And they don't know what to do. They're kicking long. Yeah. They were, they were more, much more composed at the beginning of the game. Stone's got it. They don't know what to do with this. Oh, and he breaks it in the knife on. Knife on turns on him. Shot. It's a shot and hold it. Oh, it's over. Just a good idea. Good pressure. Now, see, that's a good work. I like that. Stone with the hustle. It gets the ball in the knife on and a good turn. Yep. And Culver Military is scrambling a little bit. They're on their heels. And Dragons need to apply pressure. Here's going to be the, the backbreaker for the Dragons. If they weather the storm and they don't get a goal and about 15 minutes in, then Culver Military will start getting momentum and confidence again, and that's going to hurt the Dragons. Huh? Coach Vaney will just have to keep an eye on his yep. players and get fresh guys in there. Weather the storm. And Tompkins makes a good play forward. Broke up. Right now it's Argus's energy, which is um, turn this game. Go to your bench early. Get guys in and out. Get them breathers. I tell you what, much improved the beginning of this half compared to the start of the game. And the Fong chips it wide. A little strong, a little yep. strong. Yep. Dang it. Running, bouncing off his knee, and then trying to chip it forward, just a little heavy. In that instance, I'd, I'd like Owen to try to bring that down to his feet. He's at the top of the box. If he can get a window, he's got a leg on him. Well, he's got the strength. He's got the strength to keep it. So, not the best hit. Pablo steps to it, and unfortunately his first touch is out. Those, they just let that one roll out and get a throw in. <clears throat> yep. But they're in hustle mode right now. Yep. They're getting to the ball, and it's, it's doing them wonders. Pressure rolls over, forces 
A long ball should be easy for Stone to deal with. Oh, he oh. plays it back and it's broken up, but he cuts back immediately and takes possession again. Foul on CMA. Yep, grabbed a hold of him afterwards. I don't, and actually slowed down the Dragons by calling the foul. Just plays it smart. First touch. Oh, Richards. Yep. And that's a bad first touch led to a turnover. And they give balls in play. I don't think it ever came settled, though. Okay, Argus can't lose their mo can't lose their momentum, can't lose their hustle. There we go. There's Nifong, plays it forward. They got, we got Chino. Two two. Chino oh, can't get slips. his feet. Can't get his feet. Oh, they had two v two there. But look at is that Manikowski all the way up there? Yep. <laughs> the that is Sam up. Manikowski. <laughs> He's all about the wheels. Madman Manikowski. Devin Allen tries to slip it forward. Devin Allen gets it. Oh, 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 oh where's the foul? He grabbed his head. It should have been a dangerous play. Did you turn me down, Phil? Yeah. I just did the one time, just the one time. He's killing me, Smalls. We hit the goalpost. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do we have here? We have a player down. Did they stop play? No, they didn't, so he didn't have to come out. I don't know, they did. Did he come out? I don't know what they're doing. Must be a drop kick. Yeah, he's got to come out if they stop play for it. I don't know. Drop kick. Shook hands and played the ball. Now they're playing wider. And hits it forward. Manikowski. Now it's played wide. And the Dragons need to pay attention on the long ball because that's what Culver Military is going to work on because the Dragons are putting numbers forward. Headed out by Richards. Ran through. Markley. Played out. And it's going to be Eagles throw in. All right. Vanderbilt might want to start going to his bench. Looks like Argus <laughs> is starting to slow down a little bit here. Well, we're going to see what happens. Manikowski heads it out. Handball. Sure was. Handball, and he knows it. Yep. Stone. Nifong needs to get back up there. Good hit. And it's through to Allen. Allen with the touch. Pablo gets it. Goes back into pressure for some reason. He needs to turn that to the outside where Nifong was making a run past him. Nifong. Chino battles. Chino gets the ball, and it's broke up by Culver Military again. Black throw. Black yeah. throw. Here we go. Center head, and they are changed. Well, I tell you what, Coach Green. Colonel, the Colonel, as we call him, nickname. He's he's probably not be happy with how uh, his Eagles are playing uh, at the beginning of this half. No, they are not handling the pressure very well at all. <clears throat> coach Green's been a coach for the Eagles for a long time now. He's done a fantastic job with that squad. Always oh, a power. Gets those boys. Oh, that's a big kick. Whipped into shape. Tackled, played forward. Tompkins, even Tompkins is a little bit off on the recent. Good ball forward, way off sides. Yep. 
way offsides. Offside. And then he kicked it anyways. That should be a could be a card. All right, all this effort needs to pay off for the Dragons here pretty quick. We're past the 10 minute mark. Yep. Stone. Pablo can't settle it. Oh, what a tackle by Nifong. He's and gonna, he's got it. He's going to take him to the line. Falls down. All right, look for a big throw here out of Nifong. <laughs> Knife all, all over the place. That's there a great throw. Headed oh. out. Can it be a corner? It is corner. a corner. <laughs> Takes it off the flag. <laughs> it gets the old bounce. Gets the old college bounce for the Dragons. All righty. All right. <laughs> all right. Stone, let's see what he can do here. If he knife can, knife knife hog's walking. Trying to catch his breath after all that running. He's not in a hurry. He says just let him run in. Waits till him. Stone watches and finds it. And it's knuckled short. And it's Pablo in the middle. It. Oh, he's oh, making a miss. <laughs> oh. Foul on the Dragons. Uh, two swings. Oh, that is good. Two swings at it. Oh, my oh, word, boys. That, that, that would have been clearance. huge. Yep. That would have been huge. That could have been the straw that broke the camel's back for uh, Culver Military if they would have put that in. Great play forward. He's onside. Can we get it clear? Uh, yep. Sloppy play out of the moment at that end. Pablo gets it clear. Chino's on it. Roke has it. Somebody needs to help him. Gets around him. Corner kick for the Dragons. Yes, sir. Good. All right, can we make this one pay off? Oh, my word. <laughs> Coach Ranger was not sub this half. We're going to see what happens here. His typical schedule is he usually doesn't start until about 15, 20 in. Better ball. Oh, 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 if he had jumped on that, he'd have had it. Ball's played out, and now Culver has 2v2. McCramer. All he's got to do is slow him oh, down. He does. Coming. There it is. Stone. And here comes Culver Military. Chips forward. Offsides. Offsides. Yep. Good, Offsides. good trap by the Dragons. Yep. And Coach Green's letting his players have it, telling them, you can't just stand there. you got to be onside. Ball's played forward quick. Good touch. Richards can't get to it. Richards with the shove. Silly, silly foul by Richards. Looks like uh, Vanderbilt's going to his bench. Looks like uh, Cameron Markley and Will Mills getting ready to midfield. Which they need it. They've been they the boys have been running their yep. butts off. Richards hits forward. Allen miss hits, but Chino Roke. Allen get, get to, to it. it. Tompkins. Tompkins again. I tell you what, that kid's got some sticky feet. Redinger <laughs> plays it out to Stone. Stone hits it with his right. Allen with the great settle. Man's coming hard. What can he do? Puts it in. Oh, and he puts it right to the Culver Eagles. My phone, it's out of bounds. And substitutions. Two for two. In for CMA, number five, Carson Miser. And number nine, Fernando Garcia. And for the Dragons, number five, Will Mills. And number six, Cameron Markley. Well, here we go. Get these boys in here. Keep the pay, fast pace up and the momentum. Roke chases across. 
Keeps it in play. Looks. Hits it forward. He's onside. Can he get in? He Heavy touch. And it's broke up at the end. Dragons have numbers now. Dragons have numbers if they go forward to slow. Oh, oh my Lord. Build that. Build that. That's, I just was ready to say, if they build it, run it slow, and they can work it forward. Will Mills hits it off of the Culver Military player. And uh, just then the instant long hit. Why? You had the numbers. Build it in. Out of bounds. going to be a throw in for the Eagles. Headed forward by the defense. He's not off sides. Cuts in. Cuts in. Broke up by Manikowski, and it's played out, and it's going to be. It's going to stay in. Saved, played, and dropped. The Eagles cuts in. He's got some speed. Shot. What a save by Markley. What a save by Markley again. <laughs> what a dive. Gotta get it clear. Swing and a miss. Nifong with the hit. And that's Argus is gonna be happy to reset after that. Gotta go at an angle. If you're gonna hit that long like that, go at an angle. Markley misreads that one. Will Mills breaks it up. Still breaks it up. Kicks it forward. And he's on. Nope. Flags up. Six. He sure looked on to me. He looked on to me. But I don't have the angle. Yep, he's down there ground level. And Coach Green's not happy with the call. But the AR's been there the entire time. Nifong's taking the kick. Not sure why. I'd rather have him up trying to score it. Me too. Smashed. Broke. Header. It's loose. Collision. Oh. And the ball's free. And now comes Culver. The Eagles splits him. He has a run on it. Stone's got to cut him off, and he does. Oi, what's that call? I guess he shoulder tackled him, but I thought he had he had possession. Yeah, I, uh, it's I, hard for me as an official to call the person who has possession, <laughs> but because uh, he has the right to defend it. But must have been a little too much. Nifong with the smash caddy corner. Pablo missed. Roke doesn't go to it, and Culver does. And somebody, one of the girl fans down there, just yelled at him to go to the ball. Played out. Out of bounds. Throw in. Getting pretty handy out there. It is. It's 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 Culver Argus. It's <laughs> the military. <laughs> As we always used to say, it's the military versus the farm. Who's got the strength? <laughs> they definitely have some speed. It's broke up, and it continues on, and it's broke up by Stone. Stone plays it forward. Roke, offsides. And now it's just a kicking game, and who's going to be offsides more? The Dragons are for Culver. I want to see some people play it. Work it forward. you got to be able to, to control that aggressiveness and... That's when the and Dragons had the most pressure. Play. Yeah, when they had the most pressure, when we worked it down there, and just then we got towards the box, and then we started really working it dead center and battling. Mr. AR needs to be in line with that. He's a little caught off guard. He timed his run well. Turned. Teddy's going to come forward. Mills. Tompkins. Markley. Drops, plays it. Miss hit. Stone splits him. Nice. This is a knife on. Nifong now plays it to the corner for Roke. Roke's gonna have to have to outrun him. Hit players. Turns. To the, he hit players to the oh, right. Oh, he miss hits it. He had, 
Knife only had two players on his right wide yep. open. Yep. Slow it down, boys. Slow it down. Roke just all he had to do was turn it, and he dribbled it out. 20 minutes left in the game. Dragons trail 2-1, to one, and it's been a great battle the entire second half, back and forth. Dragons have had more pressure. Oh, my word. That's just a streak. <laughs> Devin Allen does some push-ups. <laughs> a little bit of an insult to the big guy who just lowered his shoulder and smashes him. He does some push-ups while he's down there. He's like, hey, I'm not hurt. Oh, there's a time. Right there, and he's, yep. I think he hit the ball or something when he's setting it up. And, he, yep, he yeah. gets a yellow card. He's getting the right act red tune right now. Right in your number down. He's got to be subbed off. Number seven with the yellow. No. But you should announce. No flash photography, please. Because there's flashes going off people around the defenses. All right. What can the Dragons do with this? Play forward. Headed out. Pablo. Misses. Headed out. Dragons retain it. And it's broke up. Great hustle by the Eagles. And he heads it and keeps it in. And he works. He's going to get called for that push, though. <clears throat> Sam stepped in front of him and his arms were out. You're going to get called on that. Yep. And I tell you what, Coach Green may not agree with all the calls that Jerry or the center officials doing, but he has been nothing but consistent the entire game. He's called it the exact same way the entire time. So. Is the AR saying it was out first? Nope. Nope. Free kick. It's broke up. It's in the middle. And Allen can't get to it. Manikowski runs forward. Roke misses. Chino has not been on today at nope. all. Unfortunately for him. Headed forward. Coach Vanderbilt might be wanting to look at another option here. <laughs> Some Sometimes kids just don't have their night. Yep. Played back, throw in for the Dragons. Miss hit. Off cover again, throw in. Headed forward. Roke has it, looks to cross. Got too many on him. It's going to be Can you foul. He had to hold of him. Nice. Yep. That's no. It was obvious. I could see that from here. Yeah. It was too obvious. Works just like a corner here. Maybe, what, five feet in? So Stone will have to let off just a little bit. In swinger. The first last two have been a little bit lower. I asked for distance here. Can the Dragons pull some magic out? Nice hit, and it's headed forward. Great defensive play by the Eagles. And <laughs> he wanted to head it forward and continue his run. And there's a foul by the Dragons. You betcha. Good call. Not a bad foul. Oi. With that that ball wasn't settled. No, it wasn't. And the AR should be waving this flag to let him know. I tell you what, Culver Military is very sharp like that. They do not waste time. They know the faster they take it, the better chance they have people off of uh, off of guard. And there's Markley with the catch. And they don't waste any time. No, they've done that well. Markley with the big hit. Missed hit. Bounces. Oh, it's right there. The head to Roke. Roke trying to battle. He's got two. Turns it. Looks. Ball. Puts it in the middle and it's broke up. Cameron Markley's Markley going to have a chance at it. Try to turn in line. 
Oh, and he pulls back on him. Cross, and... It's hit! It's 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 scores! Pablo scores! Pablo Mata! Pablo Mata gets the goal! Ball from Markley, and Pablo Mata gets it in! And Nifong's laying there. Here's the replay. Goal by number 11, Pablo Mata. Assisted by number 6, Cameron Markley. And, oh, my word, uh, that turns the game upside down now. It's 2 all, and the Dragons got 15, 16 minutes left in the match. And what a play. Markley, individual, pullback, gets around his man and makes the opposite foot, left-footed cross, and the Dragons have numbers forward, and Nifong and Mata almost battle for it. Both of them going after it. Mata puts it in. Dragons tie it. 16 minutes left in the game. Foul by the Dragon Sand. It's going to be call for military. <laughs> oh, my word. <laughs> this is what we like to see. This should be an interesting 15 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> well, the Dragons have had the pressure on Culver and they've not been able to handle some of this. Now they do not need to let off. Put the pressure down yep. and go after it. Don't change your game. Yep. Uh, too many times teams change their game. Oh, that's got to be a card. It should be a definite card. He does Mark. another push-up. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing push-ups, and number three is going to – Tompkins is holding his leg. Hopefully there's nothing wrong with him, but that's kind of a – That should have been a card. It, that's one of those I – stop the clock. It only stops when they wave the sign. Yep, he's got to give us the signal. No, that came from Culver Military. All right, there's a player down, and now he's up instantly. He's got to go off. You can't yep. just stop the clock. As these kids, I tell you what, either you're hurt or you're not. Yep. It drives me insane. In CMA, Back in my day, if you could stand, you could play. <laughs> I tell you what. But that's the kind of stuff that it ends up hurting his team. Now his coach has got to go say, well, if you're going to fake it or whatnot, Head it up. It's still in the air. Still in the air again. Still in the air. Mark Look shot by Mark Lee, and it's just high with the opposite foot. <laughs> if you could have gotten over that. No, if the winner of this, if Culver wins, they win it. If we win this, we have to play Bethany for t Saturday's game. will yep. be for the, the championship. championship. We can win the conference by beating Bethany. Yes, by, by CMA. By Culver. Hammer! And what a save. Uh, no, I don't think they are. No, they're not in the conference. Nope. The Dragons had a header, and it was a great save. Markley with the throw in. Dragons applying the pressure. Oh, and there it is. It's a shot. Oh, by. oh, Ellis with a chance. He'd like to have that yeah. back. Good, good touch by Chino. And I tell you what, it has been a totally different game since the second half. Yeah, I think it started in that, in that first half. It started to turn, and then uh, that goal really helped us. And then, uh, but this second half has been owned for the most by the Dragons. Yep. Headed forward, Roke tries to spin off his man, can't get to it. Played wide. It's going to be good touch in. Plays broke up. It's going to go to fall to the military. Hits it off his back. A little bit of luck there. Pablo plays it forward. Roke steps to it. He's oh, hit he's from behind. The ball. He's totally hit from behind. Took a minute. <laughs> Composed himself, but snapped right up. Yep. Stone going to have a kick in. His services are pretty good. Let's see what we can do here. Markley steps back and helps field it out. Gets that depth that you need. Knuckles down, little loaf, headed back. McCramer gets beat. 
Manikowski backpedals. McCramer, good ball forward. He's got to run, and Manikowski beats him to it. Manikowski with the outstep. Oh, pushes him down. And both of them. <laughs> Missed. Missed. Oh, big mistake, big mistake. He's making up for it, though. Watch, oh, come back, he's open. And he oh. Missed it. oh, my word, if he passes in the middle, the game is done. And he tries to shoot at an impossible angle. Oh, my word, Coach Green's going to be living about that. Just tap it in the center. It's a walk-in goal. He had a guy without anybody <laughs> within 10 feet of him standing oh. at the six. Walk-in goal, and... Wow. So this will go to overtime being a conference game. Ball's played. Now military is trying to work their way back into this game. Oh, Stone foul. muscled out. Oh. I thought I saw extension on that. That's all right. He plays it. He dribbles it out of bounds. Goal kick. Goal kick. Redinger offers assistance to the player. Stone needs I need one player to go wide. You can't just play down the center. Yep. Roke can't get to it. Chino could use a five-minute break. Yeah, there's some players out there getting tired for Argus. And that's right. There's another mistake. And oh, oh shake upon us. I tell you what, McCramer has made two. Big time mistakes in the last three minutes, and we have been quite lucky that they have not converted. McCramer just needs to settle down. I know everybody's excited and adrenaline and everything else. They just need to relax. <laughs> Smith is over here practicing his foreign language skills. Headed forward. Played it back. Broke up. Nifong. Allen shields it well. Pablo plays it forward. Chino Roke. If he can he should bounce. Turns. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Oh, the middle. Was there. And it's broke up. Ellis drops to Stone. Stone puts it back over. Right over to Nifong. Nifong with a shot. Go! See that from Nifong? Oh my word! Oh, a great cross. Oh, got it on! What a! Oh, sorry about that. A little bit loud. Got a little bit loud there. Sorry about that. But you're not going to see a better pass and a greater finish the rest of this season. What a volley by Nifong! Oh, fantastic. Now the Dragons need to maintain their composure. The game is not over. There's 10 minutes left. They're only up. It does not mean it's over. They've got to relax and play the game smart. <laughs> oh, boy. I'll keep my composure. There it is. <laughs> what a hit from Nifong. No doubt about it, that's going to be the goal of his career this year. Just this whole, man, fantastic stuff. Headed up. Markley comes back, headed forward. And Pop, well, nope, Redinger drills it out. All yeah. right. Uh, yeah, don't allow Culver to have the pressure. Yeah. Stone hits it out, and it's off of a Culver military. Might want to start looking at some subs. Yeah, if you can. Get some, get some fresh <laughs> players in there. Keep the hustle going. <laughs> Keep the pressure. Ellis, going. fantastic again. Ellis is battling three. Not giving up. Markley. And he breaks it away. Allen. Can't get it. The pressure's there. Oh, and a good little move out of Culver. And here's the long ball back across. McCramer. And here comes Manikowski. No problem for Manikowski. Until he falls down. <laughs> <laughs> he looked up to see where he's going to pass and missed the ball. Broke up. McCramer hits it forward. Chino's Rokes. by himself. Settles. Who's? Yep, yep, hold it up. 
Hold it up, wait for some help. He's got five. He's going to be run off of it. They'll lose possession, but it's taking it away, and that's going to force that, and that's just fine for the Dragons. Yeah. No big hurry. Slow down, ball boy. What are you doing? Nate, settle down. <laughs> 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 Roke, not in a hurry. Relaxes, throws it down deep. Allen plays it off of call from Rote, kick. corner kick. That's corner kick. Oh, oh, oh my oh, word. We played it off of him. That was a smart play by Allen. And here comes Will Mills coming back in. Ellis with the big header. Miss hit. Culver Military is going to go get anxious and start doing the long ball syndrome. So the Dragons just got to be deep and prepared. McCramer with the miss. Would you drop Owen? Yeah, I'd drop Owen. Put Owen at center. Deep. Owen, look at Owen. He's back himself. You don't even have to tell him. He knows. Players in the middle. Well, look out. And it's oh, broke up. Out. Ellis hits it forward. And it's miss hit. And now Rook's on the break. S slow it down, Chino. You got Devin coming. He looks for cut. He needs to go yep, wide. He does. Yep. Markley. Markley settles. Drops time. it. Bye Ellis. Else. Plays it to feet. Pablo fakes it. Gets it over to Woke. Shot. And it's blocked. Great, great composure out of the Dragons. We were just talking about it. And that's a good sequence down on the offensive end. And Markley comes out. Mills is going in. Okay, let's see what else has. Going short. Here comes across. It's loose. Broke up. Culver military. Plays it out. Knocked forward. Still in. Off of the military. It's going to be Dragon throw in again. Six minutes left in the match. Dragon's up three to two. Headed corner kick for the Dragons. And Nifong not even going up. <laughs> <laughs> you stay where you're at. <laughs> Matikowski, Nifong, Redinger, McCramer in the back. Great ball in. He's loose, and it's headed. And here comes the, the academy. And Nifong's going to outrun him and play it out wide for throw in. And the Dragons are getting back. Kramer looks, fakes. Here's a cross. Headed out. Will Mills with the big head. Knocks it out. They played in. Redinger. Missed. Pablo. Trying to collect it. Mills. Mills. Persistence. Breaks through. Mills. Persistence. Breaks through. And the ball gets taken away. And it's played forward to Roke. Roke needs to settle. Yep, he's got Mills in the middle if he wants him. He there does. Is. Oh, handball! He dove in front of it with his arms. No call given. Oh, that is terrible. That was obvious. Good step by Stone. Manikowski hits it forward. Miss hit. Mills with a great tackle. Oh, my word, that was all ball. Ha <laughs> ha. Mills come in and been tenacious. Great tackle. Play an advantage. Ball's played in the middle. Oh, he's got a guy right there, and he doesn't feed it to him. Manikowski hits it out. Roke has it again. Roke needs to take it to the corner. Yep. Three and a half left. He's got Ellis in the middle if he wants him, though. Not anymore. Extends the arm, uses his body well, and takes it away from Roke. Stone's not wasting any time, puts it all the way to Roke. Heads it into the middle. <clears throat> Goes right around him. Nifong trails with the runner. McCramer hits it out, Dragon set up. Mills needs to drop. Pablo needs to drop. Devin Allen's already dropped. Ellis needs to drop. Ellis needs a sub, something fierce. <laughs> He's got his arm on his hip, breathing. 
He's had a fantastic job today. This is where your heart and character shows in a match like this. Ball's in. Dangerous. Headed. Hit. Mark is going to come up with it. Markley has it. Two minutes, 40 seconds left. Headed back by the Military Academy. He's going to save it. Hits it forward instantly. One bounce. Headed. Mills breaks it up. Mills battles through it. Oh, my word. That's straight card. I, that's a card. He had a chokehold on him. Huh? That's violent conduct. That is. What's he doing there? How is that not a card? He had a hold of him around the neck. <laughs> wow. Jeez, oh, Pete. Knife on. Header. And it's punched out by the keeper. Great save. Fantastic play by the goalkeeper. McCramer. Foot race. Still has it. Out of bounds. Culver military throw in. Everybody drops. Minute 45 left. Knife on with the foul. foul. 135. Minute 35. Everybody mark. No mistakes here. Here we go. This could be a crucial moment in the match. Knife on. Drops. Heads it out. Ping pong. Head it out. Knife on. Knife on with the hit. Gabe Stone. Gabe Stone's Goals. running onto it. And he takes it. Oh, and he just misses. Plays it wide. If he goes to Teddy Ranger, a good Redinger, covers, and knocks it out. 57 seconds left in the match. It's going to go to the end, folks. <clears throat> Let him cross it. Tompkins is way off sides. <laughs> It's in the middle. Hit up in the air. Mark collects. Markley collects it with ease. Markley needs to just relax. Hit it now. Hit it now. There's got numbers. And he does. Dragons have numbers, and it's all the way at the other end of the pitch. Roke battles. Foul. That'll do it. That's going to do it. Dragons are in no hurry. Come from behind, 2-0 deficit to have three unanswered goals. It's in the corner. It's out of bounds. And that's going to do it. What a match. What a comeback victory for the Dragons. What wow. a great, what great, a great match. match. The Dragons persevere with the comeback. A totally different team second half. And that cross and that volley from Nifong, that is the highlight reel of the day. No doubt about it. What a fantastic goal. Yeah, you know, Arker started out slow and then just poured, on, poured in the heart and the game turned around for him. Oh, my word. What a way to have finished for senior night for the Dragons with a 3-2 to two victory against Culver Military, the longest rivalry in Indiana soccer history for high school. And the Dragons come out on top for... Everyone here for Argus TV at RTC4 TV4. We're here tomorrow night for the girls' senior night as well. We're going to be back on Monday covering the girls' volleyball for senior night. And then uh, the first round of sectional action here on Eugene Snyderfield from Argus, Indiana. With that, Andy Stone, Bill Mills, Peyton on the camera, Phil at the computer. Thank you. God bless.